Gonna do a quick video on how not to get scammed when purchasing military surplus firearms. Number one, if somebody says, I know what I got, immediately disregard them. When purchasing a firearm for historical relevance, and what I mean by that is the price is higher because of some kind of historical fact about it, make sure that you have proof. That could be something like a letter or photographs or a letter from a veteran's commanding officer allowing them to bring the firearm back from wherever they came from. Another thing to look out for is an import mark. An import mark is something you'll probably see something on like maybe a K98 made in Germany or imported from Germany, you'll see it somewhere on the barrel or somewhere else on the firearm. Matching numbers. So the price of a firearm could go up or down depending on if the numbers are matching on the firearm. Having matching numbers indicates your firearm is the same way it was when it rolled off the assembly line. It goes without saying, but also make sure that you look at things like the bore and indicate that the firearm is actually in working order. Some people sell you stuff that doesn't work. 